Hi friends, I'm Mikhail Ocean. Hello. Have you ever thought about courage? Look at a look at a young child. Aren't they like dangerously courageous? <laughs> have you have I mean how many things will a young child try? Okay, over and over again that is just so totally dangerous to their uh to their well-being if you will. Okay, they'll run out into traffic. They'll uh, fall a thousand times learning to ride a bike. They'll fall a million times learning to walk. Okay, where where do you think that went? Okay, inside yourself. It didn't go anywhere. It's still there. And the amazing thing is the more and more we as human beings do less and less of what we desire, the more tight, the more defensive, the more resisting of life we start to do. And that has an overall effect. We feel um, that we are unable to do new things as a result of that. So the reason I painted that little picture of childhood was to um, illustrate once again that that is where everyone began. We all, we all have that in common, okay? And that courage, that desire is still within. So don't try to think or let's say follow what your brain might be trying to tell you of how you have to uh, uh, become courageous or how you have to read uh, endless books about how to be courageous or how to follow your passion and, and things like that. I'm pointing out the obvious and that is you already are those things. You simply need to allow, excuse me, accept first and then allow the flow of that in your life. You want to unlock your, your potential. You want, to, you want to really drive forward in your life. Simply accept some of the real things about yourself that are so totally natural. All right, and then you can actually have an incredible journey. And actually, you can dream really, really big. One thing that I have recognized in my own journey is that um, those big dreams, those dreams uh, that uh, one has when they're smaller, okay, smaller in size, okay, um, uh, those dreams are, are just... Um, they're just uh, imagination and they're, they're just unbridled ability and potential. There's an acknowledgement. There's a recognition of the potential. Okay, you can do that again. You can do that right now. Allow yourself to dream big as you want to dream. Uh, that will get your emotions and everything al in alignment with that desire. Because that emotional power is what's necessary. So you don't, you have courage, okay? You have imagination. You have all of these gifts that were given to you, okay, right from the start. Begin first with, with uh, unshackling your belief systems and your brain, okay, to everything that you've always done, okay, and uh, start fresh, Look at things from a new place. If what you've already done will contribute to what it is that you desire, then by all means, incorporate that into that dream or that, uh, that movie for yourself. But if it doesn't, you can discard it. You don't need to keep it. You don't need to make everything that you've done already fit into your new picture, okay, or your new uh, dream or manifestation that you're that you're after. So hopefully this will be very helpful 
if none other than to cause you to think and contemplate about how much you are tying yourself up in your own life, okay? And just not allowing yourself to fully charge ahead, okay? In an unbridled way, okay? Into the future or the moment right now that you desire most. So if you like what you hear here and are interested in hearing more, please um, check me out at resultsvelocity.com. I give away a free coaching lesson there, coaching session I should say, and um, I talk about alignment. All right, in that free session. So it's resultsvelocity.com. Otherwise, give me a reaction right here. I would really appreciate, okay, your comments, a reaction, okay, a question, okay, even what it is that you think that may contradict what I just said. Dialogue is wonderful. We'd appreciate it very much. So leave me a comment here. Find me at resultsvelocity.com and have an incredible day. We'll talk soon. Bye.